glides forward by moving a bit backward. The 1983 T-Bird was reduced in size. It was only one and a half inches longer than the 55 model. Powered by an optional turbocharged four-cylinder engine, race car driver Jackie Stewart beat a BMW 733 CSI at the California racetrack in front of the motoring press. The bird was back. Sales in 1984 reached more than 170,000. And in 1989, Thunderbird was voted Car of the Year by Motor Trend magazine. The new T-Birds are not only back with eye-catching style, but have proven to be the most trouble-free American cars designed and built in North America from 1981 to 1988 in a series of surveys based on average owner-reported problems. There are three models for 89. The basic Thunderbird with its sleek aerodynamic lines, 3.8 liter V6 engine, sequential electronic fuel ejection, rack and pinion steering, and lightweight, high strength aluminum and magnesium components is a responsive, good looking, and fun car. The Super Coupe with a supercharged V6, capable of over 200 horsepower and 300 foot pounds of torque along with four-wheel disc brakes, electronically adjustable suspension, and traction lock axle, just to name a few of its features, is a true sporty car. The new T-Birds are proof that the Thunder is back in Thunderbird.